Some actions that you take during the interview can certainly ruin your chances to pass. One of the first deciding factors during the interview is at the very start, be on time. It's a pretty obvious topic to talk about, but it also occurs very often. And yes, most people are late because of factors outside of their control, like traffic and accidents, etc. But is it really outside of their control? As a professional recruiter, I have been in countless interviews and it amazes me how many people arrive late for the interviews. On the phone, they tell me this is a dream job, this is the path they want to take, yet the chances are ruined because of being late. The importance of being on time for interviews, it goes to show how enthusiastic you are, what kind of person you are, and how much you really care about your career. So, if you are arriving late for your interviews, here are five ways to fix that bad habit. Search interview address on Google Map at least one day before, so you understand beforehand how to get there. This will give you a boost of confidence to know, hey, I'm not going to get late tomorrow, and reduce the panic for the interview. Using Google Maps is easy. Just type in your destination and choose your method of transport. Then you will have the estimated travel time to your destination. You can also use street view function to see the building, which will help you recognize it quickly when you arrive there. Set multiple alarms on your smartphone and clock. As crazy as it sounds, some people just can't wake up with the first alarm. A way to combat this is to set multiple alarms in one minute intervals. I can guarantee you will not sleep in. To avoid any unexpected situation with your smartphone, it's best to have a clock on the side. Leave your place earlier. This is one of the main reasons why public transport and the traffic is making you late. You can't possibly think that you will arrive on time during the peak hours. If you think you will arrive on time, you will arrive late. If you think you will arrive early, you will arrive on time. Think of it that way. If you feel like traffic and public transport are factors outside of your control, leave early and you will be amazed. There have been cases before with our candidates that failed to find a car park in time, resulting in them panicking. So it's important to understand beforehand where you are going to park. You may live close to the company that you applied for a job with. But if you travel during the peak hour, it can make over one hour travel time difference as compared to travel at the non-peak hours. If you are unsure about how long your travel time will be, take your time, check on Google Maps, and check with your friends. This aligns with the first tip. If your daily schedule allows you to, or you're just nearby, then physically check into the interview place do it to make yourself more comfortable in the interview place and get familiar with the building. By doing so, you will not get lost because some places are difficult to find. You will have confidence before going to the interview and overall, you will just feel more relaxed. It's my job as a professional recruiter to support all that are looking for a job. I hope I have helped you with the first step of the interview process. Go down into the comment section below and tell me have you ever been late to an interview? And did this video help you out? Leave a comment and hit the like button and subscribe for more interview tips in the future. My name is Suhi Fei.